Well, the good news here is that there are no reports of injuries, but this North Hollow subdivision where we're at right now in Humble was one of the hardest hit. You can see Mother Nature's strength here just behind me. These two huge trees completely uprooted, landing on the guest house, according to the homeowner. Luckily, no one was inside, and its neighbors here dealing with much of the same. The roofs, you can see, have tarps on them, and they've been working throughout the day to try to clean up the mess here. You can see just out front the limbs and the tree trunks that had been collected. The damage was done overnight. This tree was all the way across the street and neighbors were checking on neighbors and it was just, it was scary. <laughs> It was scary. I've never had anything like that before. Strong winds bringing down trees, causing heavy damage to several neighborhoods. This one taking out part of this upstairs bedroom. Another landing directly on this car in the North Hollow subdivision. Residents saying the tornado touched down at about 1.30 this morning. We went to bed, and when we woke up this morning, my husband said it's bad. It's very, very bad. So we went around and checked on the neighbors next door, and everybody seemed to stick together, and they started cleaning it up. Outside out of the neighborhood, the roof of a commercial building ripped apart, with some of it landing about a quarter mile away, according to authorities. And again, the damage here widespread throughout the area. Some homes obviously worse than others, but residents here getting an early start to this morning, doing what they can, trying to get back to normal. We're live in Humble Bill Barajas, KPRC 2 News.